Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm painting Bernie Sanders, so I thought I'd show you a little bit of my process. Um, I have a couple of base coats down already, so I'm just adding to that. Watercolor, remember, is about building up layers. So I started with this base color here, uh, which is raw sienna. Raw sienna, mixed with a little bit of alizarin crimson red, and a lot of water. A lot of water makes it very light. So right now I'm adding different colors into it. As you can see from my reference here, I need some shadow on his chin, some other colors on the side there, so I'm blending that together. While it's still wet, blend it together. Holding the camera as I'm doing this, so forgive me if it's a little shaky. I'm using a tiny brush because this is a small painting. So I'm going to get some on his nose there. So getting a darker color, I'm mixing. Um, this dark brown is really good. It's called Van Dyke Brown. And it's really good to mix with stuff to get darker colors. And you can even add some blue in there to get like a darker reflection and shadow. So I'm going to add some to his nose here. It's a little too dark, so I'm going to pick some of that up with some water. And just add in wherever I see the darker colors. I'm going to put some in his eye here. And his mouth. Just little dark colors because you're going to build it up and get darker and darker as you go along. So you can see it's just basic stuff now. And I'm just going to keep going and going and building up those layers. While parts of it are drying, you can use a bigger brush and get like a background. So I'm going to get some blue for the background mixed with some browns and blacks and stuff, some water, and we're going to go on the background minus his white hair. So just like that, keep going back, get some more and some water. Be careful. Because if you add the wet color to the wet of his face, if it's still wet, it's going to blend together. It's going to bleed together, and it might mess you up a little bit. So if you're getting really close to another color, make sure that the first one is dry first. So as you can see, I didn't, I'm going to leave the white of the paper for his hair. Because the whitest you can get is the paper white. So the stuff is drying a little bit on his face. I'm dropping my, my brushes all over the floor. So I'm just going to add some darker colors around. He's got like a lot of red in there. And you can, probably can't see from here, but there's like a lot of red in his face. So I'm going to mix more red in here with some of the... Or a sienna. Not too much red, because it's going to... Red's a very powerful color. If you get too much, it's going to just overtake everything else. But you can always dull it down with more water. And then go back and add that red in there. And this chin here. You can see it's still very light, so... Just gonna keep building it up and building it up. His nose. His ear is kind of his ear is very red, so I'm gonna add some more red. Sorry, more red. 
a little too much. But his ear is very <laughs> red, so we're gonna just put some in there. Let that dry for a little bit, and then we'll go back and add more dark. Uh, let's see. So we've just got to decide where you want to go next while other parts are drying. So I'm going to fix his chin a little bit. We're going to go really dark now. I'm going to get some more of this dark mixture here, add some more. Some Van Dyke Brown. It's really cool. If you have Van Dyke Brown and um, Ultramarine or... Yeah, Ultramarine Blue. And you mix those together, you get like really good grays and blacks. So I'm gonna go add some that shadow on his chin there. Or his neck. A little bit under his mouth there. Getting really dark now. It's a little too dark still for me. I um, think I'm just going to leave you guys now. So it's going to just keep going and going and going. And the layers are going to keep building and getting darker and darker. And eventually we'll have Bernie Sanders. So it takes a while. It takes a lot of patience. But you just got to keep going little bits at a time. Just building it up. Wherever you see the darker colors, just add those in. And I'll post a picture on my Instagram of the final piece. Alright, happy painting guys. Until next time, if you have any questions, let me know.